Yes, sir. Big, big monster. Big Miata. In the works. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait. That's not the right motor. Hold on. LS the world, people. Okay. Y'all go rock with my bro, man, on the Instagram. He got some shit coming. This there big is. drift missile right here. It'll be there. It's going to be crazy. And who knows? Maybe J.I. will get behind the wheel at one of the events. Let me know down in the comment section down below if that's something you guys want to see. But um, we just got to his house. About to go ahead and uh, start working on this trunk setup, man. So I'm going to set you guys up and we're going to get to work. Give me one second. It's your boy J.I. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Enjoy the video. You did. What's good, J.I.? You what I'm saying? And welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. Got to put the seatbelt on, man. Got to be safe. Got the homie in the whip with me today. This is a new face, you know what I'm saying? None of y'all know, bro. But um, today, you see the title and you see the thumbnail. Y'all already know that I've been wanting to switch up my management and my trunk and really get to my trunk set up. We're going left or right? Oh, you can go left. Okay. Um, and really get into my trunk setup. And so I made a post on my story asking, um, you know, who could really help me mount my tank and my compressor like the way that I want to do it. And one of the homies, what bags, um, you know what I'm saying? He hit me up and mentioned bro so i hit him up and the rest is history so right now we're on the way to go get some you know some materials to get this job done but trust yeah. me this dude here like his creativity is like on the same level as mine and i haven't like really met anyone who who can match it like when we were wrapping it up just you know basically like you know what i'm saying coming up with the concept we were gonna do oh yeah like bro like it was like, it was just like finishing each other's sentences in a, in, a, in a sense, you know what I'm saying? And I really fuck with that, so I want y'all to do me a favor. He's about to tell y'all his Instagram right now. I want y'all to do me a favor, y'all go check him out. Y'all go show him love, because trust me, the way this trunk finna look, I'm already knowing a lot of y'all are gonna ask <laughs> who the fuck did it, how'd I get it done, where'd I go? So y'all hit up my boy. Go ahead, brother. Yeah, my Instagram is gonna be uh, underscore root beer float underscore <laughs> uh, you gotta include it i guess but yes uh, i'm gonna put it on the screen yeah we're gonna try to keep it simple we'll, we're gonna float the tank on the trunk lid so as soon as you pop the trunk you'll see it right there we can put like some some designs or uh, i mean I, i'm assuming you want to put j.i productions on there yeah yeah we're gonna we'll do like a little 3d print and we'll <laughs> like get it floating uh, maybe even do some acrylic some leds later on if we want to add on some extra shit but yeah, do that, flip the compressor, and just um, just make it look a little clean, just out of the way so you can still use your trunk space, you know? Yes, sir. Like, so like I said, bro, like, just listening to what he just said, like, just imagine that in your head. Because it's going to be in the video, obviously. <laughs> but just imagine it in your head right now and watch it come out exactly how you had it in your head at the end of this video. So without further ado, see you guys when we get to the story. All right, y'all. So... That one's not flat? Yeah, these are. Damn. Hope we can fit this shit in the car. Yeah, really. <laughs> you know, got short God damn. That joint is huge. <laughs> okay, bet, for sure. Yeah, that would be. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, well, we need to. Yeah. Straight. The first time I've ever. Bose coming in clutch. Got the metal. Got the hardware. Hell yeah. Seems like a good trip. Let's get it. Yeah, sir. So, Lowe's came in clutch. One stop shop. Got everything we need. Gonna head back to his house right now. Um, gotta make a quick stop to the ATM. You know what I'm saying? So I can pay the man. This way, brother. And then, uh,. Y'all see this trunk setup come to fruition. It's the first, like, first phases of the trunk setup. It's finna be dope. 
Take our start up. Second stop, all rallies. All right, y'all. So bet. You know what I'm saying? Finally, got we got some progress going. Basically, about to take out the whole management right now. Um, completely emptied out the tank, grabbing these wood pieces and stuff like that, and taking them out. Um, and then after after to do that, we're about to go ahead and mock up everything to the trunk, and uh, we should be set, man. It's so. Woo wee! This is gonna be crazy. My tank is free. Free falling. Like, dude. Like, dude. <laughs> yeah, man, big. I think, I think we should be straight. Yeah. As far as getting that bitch up there. Yeah. Should uh. Should clear close. perfectly. Perfectly fine. Just worried about that. Let's look, get man. this off. And hopefully this is the right size. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. If that's not the right fitting, you gotta go back to the store, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Catches the threads, but I'm gonna keep going. And I was like, Is he good? And she sends me a picture of no bueno. That's upsetting. Alright, y'all, so we came to AutoZone because my boy had a fitting already, um, and it's just a little too small, it won't thread. So, I'm trying to see if we can't find another one. That's just a little bit bigger to be able to use. Fingers crossed, man. Fingers crossed. We got a whole bunch of fittings, but we didn't. Damn. Yeah, we didn't check what that was. Yeah. All right, folks. Big uh, Home Depot trying to get the sign in there for y'all. This video is probably going to be, I'm estimating right now, the video will be like 15 damn near 20 minutes so y'all better enjoy every last minute of it if you haven't already smash that subscribe button give this video a big thumbs up i'm telling you this trunk setup is going to be ridiculous all right y'all so change of plans again even better ideas you know what i'm saying again the creativity levels it's just it's it's ridiculous so we're gonna mount the compressor and the tank on the trunk door um and that way we don't have to buy any extra line, which kind of already did, but it's not the right size. So definitely taking that back to the store. My boy had some extra. Uh, what what would you even call this? Like what? Like like what do you even call this? Um, it's just like wire. Uh, wire covers wire or something. Loom. Wire loom. So he had some extra wire loom hanging around. So we're gonna go ahead and wrap up the wires that you see, so it'll look factory like that one is, and uh, I think we should be straight. Alright y'all, so here's the progress. We got the bracket after some, you know, brainstorming, trying, brainstorming, trying, brainstorming. We came up with this right here. And um, we're about to go ahead and mock up the second end, um, the second mount for the tank. And then we'll get to getting the compressor up here. And we should be about done. Alright, dude, okay, this is just a mock-up. This is just for like test fitting and kind of want to make sure it clears yeah make sure it clears okay uh we probably just have to turn that that way and then dead ass about to this is the ultimate test right here to make sure it clears the trunk itself Ooh 
Yes, sir. Pop your trunk, Joel. All right. <laughs> Yo. That's hard, bro. That's hard, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo, like, words cannot describe my excitement right now. That, like, bro, you don't see that. One, you don't see bagged Camaros. Two, who has a trunk set up like that? Nobody. Hit up my boy. I'm trying to tell y'all. Okay, so this is going to be a two-part joint. But this is basically how far we got today. Got the tank mounted to the trunk. It looks hella good. I have to go buy some fittings because the wire for the tank, the compressor itself, is gonna hit the trunk. Um, putting it like that. So, you know, live and learn type deal. We'll be back and get it all finished up. Gotta get some extra line for the water trap as well and uh, I think we should be straight from there.